Good morning! Well, this is a bit of a different one this morning. I'm in one of these. It's a, yeah. I haven't been a class two driver for a long time. <laughs> and I've forgotten how it feels to drive one of these bloody things. That's good fun though. Something a bit different. So, my truck's in for inspection today. Um, and it's a Saturday morning. And, um, I was asked if I wanted to take a trip down to the Cotswolds. So I said, yeah, I didn't really think about it, but yeah, I haven't driven one of our um, Class 2s. It's a Class 2 with a difference though, because I haven't got a palletised load on. I haven't got a liquid load on. I've got a very, very cute load on. Yes, you heard me. Cute. I've got babies. I've got baby moo cows. Yes, I've got some calves on. These are um, dairy calves. So, a few months old. And we're running down to a farm. Down to a dairy farm down in Cotswolds. Um, from up in Cheshire. Um, yeah, they were lovely this morning. I went loaded up at 5 o'clock. Um, 5 a.m. this is. And, um, yeah, they were, they were still quite sleepy. Very cute, so very quiet. I mean, they're only baby babies. So, they're uh, Oh, I 
they would come with you.
this is not exactly easy. Wow, that's tight. Oh, nearly took him out with the back. Oh, oh, oh. oh, you can bugger off. You'll go back, not me. Some of these roads are very, very, very tight. Right, let's try and get on up and out of here before we end up with more cars coming towards us. No, stay there, stay there! <laughs> proving to be an experience it's not the tightest road I've been down I don't think um, I think I've done tighter in the Arctic uh, but certainly it's up there up there with challenging routes to drive <laughs> anyway it's all good beep beep big trucker coming through not I'm in a baby truck I don't know why these seem to be so tight I mean, it's, I'm in a tiny little diddy puddle hopper. Right. It's not like it's a big truck or anything like that. No, it's a baby. Just a baby truck. And yet, it does seem to fill these lanes quite well. <laughs> quite get used to with driving this Renault is that <laughs> the mirror is the wrong way around so to explain what that means so you have a big mirror which is normal like you'd have on your car and then you have what we call a fish fish eye mirror or a blind spot mirror or concave mirror and that concave mirror normally, for me, is on the bottom and then the normal big mirror is above. Okay, so it's a blind spot mirror, it helps you to identify 
stuff that you may not be able to normally see. So you have one on either side. Now normally in my truck, the big mirror is at the top and the concave mirror is at the bottom. On this one, I keep looking at the concave mirrors because the concave mirrors are on the top and the big mirrors are at the bottom. So I keep looking at the wrong one. And it gives the illusion that you're much tighter to stuff than you actually are. So yeah, a bit annoying. But hey, now the roads are nice and wide, so let's crack on up here, get out through the woods, and then we've got half a chance. Back onto the main roads, back onto the motorway, back up to home.